Hi, my name is Christina Govinda and today we're going to talk about attaching yarn to make an ear flap on hats. Crocheting ear flaps on hats can seem a little intimidating, but with a little direction, it's not very hard. For this, you're going to need your hat, a crochet hook, pair of scissors, and yarn. So that you can see clearly what I'm doing, I'm going to use a yarn with a contrasting color and I'm going to take my hat and go a few stitches out from the back. You can see the back because I have my tail not woven in and your ear flaps are going to go around the front, but you want them to end right towards the front of the hat, but not getting anywhere close to the face. So we're going to go back about, about three stitches out from the back of the hat. I'm going to take my crochet hook and push it through the back of the stitch, take my yarn, pull it through, then I'm going to do a slip stitch, pulling the tail through as well. I'm going to tighten the stitch, pulling on that tail, and then so that I don't have to go back and weave it in, I'm going to pull the tail to the side and I'm going to crochet it into the hat and then clip it about where I want it to be and then it'll be already woven in. Chain one, push your crochet hook under and do the same stitch that you did the rest of the project with. Mine is a single crochet. This is for a baby, so I'm going to keep the ear flap small, even a little bit smaller than what I'd like because I do a final stitch all the way around the ear flaps and the hat, which is also going to make it wider. So for the last stitch, I'm going to chain two. Turn it around. And then single crochet across again. Crochet two and then start your next row. Crochet one and then go the next stitch over. Continue doing rows like this until you've reached your desired length. Once you've reached your desired length, go ahead and clip your yarn. You're finished. What an easy and wonderful way to keep the ears of your loved ones warm. Thanks for watching.